Welcome back to HodgePodge. When working on a project in Illustrator, it's likely that you will have to change the view. The magnification level can range from 3.13% to 64,000%. The level of magnification is displayed in the Document tab next to the file name. As is with everything in Illustrator and other Adobe programs, there are many ways to perform the same action, like changing the magnification. One way to enlarge or reduce the view of the artboard is with the View menu. Go to the top menu and select View, Zoom In, or Zoom Out. This can also be done using the shortcut Command Plus or Command Minus. To revert to the standard view again, go to the top menu and select View, Fit Artboard in Window, or you could use Command Zero. This is not one that I have ever used, but say you were drawing everything to scale, you could select View, Actual Size, or use the shortcut Command-1. Depending on what you're doing and how you're illustrating, you may want or need to zoom using a different method. The Zoom tool on the toolbar will allow you to zoom with more specificity. Rather than zooming to the center, you will zoom to the area in which you have the tool placed. To zoom out, hold down the Alt or Option key. You can click and hold to continue zooming, or pull the zoom tool from left to right to zoom in and out of the artboard. To zoom in and out when using a MacBook Pro or other laptop with a touchpad, I typically will pinch to zoom in and out just like you would with a tablet. When dealing with complex drawings in Adobe Illustrator, your zoom might be delayed and sometimes so much so that it will crash the program. The likelihood of this happening will depend on the complexity of your drawing and the speed of your computer's graphics processing unit. I bring this up because I have sometimes encountered this issue with larger drawings. To zoom and work in general with documents with more information, you may have to toggle GPU performance mode on and off. When GPU performance mode is off, you may click and drag with the zoom tool to select a rectangular area to zoom in and out of. When using any tool in Adobe Illustrator, you may hold down the spacebar to quickly toggle to the hand tool, which you may use to scroll through your workspace. On most laptops, you could easily scroll on the touchpad with two fingers. For various reasons, you may need to view your artwork in different modes. I've used all of these modes throughout the years, and I'm sure there will be a time where you will also need to do so. To view a wireframe of your artwork, go to the top menu and select View Outline. Overprint will allow you to view the lines and shapes that are set to overprint. Pixel Preview Mode will allow you to view how the artwork will appear when rasterized, meaning when the vectors have been converted to pixels. This concludes the artwork viewing section of this tutorial series. Up next will be the navigation and use of artboards in Illustrator. As always, thanks for watching. Please feel free to leave a like, check out my other videos, and subscribe.